7.30 a.m. and uh, getting ready to head out to St. Louis, Missouri for a trip for work. I didn't get a chance to grab anything to eat on my trip. It was kind of a long trip. I got up early and made my way to Logan Airport and got on the plane and went to St. Louis and got the rental car and started making my way to Springfield. But I figured I'd make a quick stop and use my lunchtime to visit some sites. Hey guys, so I'm in St. Louis at the Arches, the Gateway Arches. Take a look behind me. It's a lot of overcast today. but. Made it here. One thing I didn't realize when I was down here that uh, this is actually the Mississippi River. This is where they have all the big riverboat cruises and stuff. And the backdrop here, this is uh, St. Louis, this downtown area. So I'm uh, heading down Highway 70 and I'm making my way to Springfield, Illinois. I got a job to do for work. Heading up there at uh, one of our factories and uh, gonna replace a couple of network switches and run some testing on the network. But uh, looks like there's some snow up here. It's kind of cold. Uh, 26 degrees. It's been a long day. My stomach's rumbling and uh, need some food, need some grub. So, get another 55 minutes to go. About 60 miles. We should be at our destination. So I decided to drop my bags off in, uh, after I check in the room and head out and grab something to eat. So here's the palace. This is what I got for the week. Hello. <laughs> Went to that place to get some food and uh, it's kind of a wild spot. Very nice inside, beautiful. The food was uh, delicious. I meant to take you guys with me, but uh, felt like it might have been a little much for the scenery and uh, the event. They had a trivia game going on and uh, it was pretty loud in there. I didn't get the salad I wanted, but the salad I got off it was delicious. I'm not complaining at all. Let me show you. I didn't get to take a picture of my plate of food, but... Picture of a picture, how's that? These are the cheese curds that came with my drink. Not bad, eh? And uh, it's got... It's a brewery. It's got their, they got their own brews on tap. They got about 10 beers on tap that they actually brew there. It was called um, E-Grain, E-Grain Brewery and Pub House, something like that. It was delicious. I recommend it if you're ever in uh, Springfield, Missouri. It's a must try. So I spent a few days in the office and I took care of the switch and a couple of network issues and some end user support and then uh, I had a little downtime so I was going to go visit uh, Lincoln, Lincoln's tomb and his burial site and maybe his house. Just arrived uh, on Abraham Lincoln's home and we're going to take a tour of it. We're going to take a look at his, uh, his, this historic site where all the houses are in the neighborhood where Abe Lincoln grew up. So I'm going to take you guys with me. And check it out okay so the next tour is until 1040 I have to be in uh, st. Louis by then so they ain't gonna work for me so I'm gonna have to take a just a walkthrough they gave me a little pamphlet here I'm gonna put this in my dash 
so I can because you had to pay two dollars an hour for parking which is fine because the tour and everything else is free here if you want to go to it so I can't complain I'm gonna set this in my dash and then uh, they gave me this little self-guided tour a little map here pamphlet shows you where to go and the attractions everything's labeled shows you where you are it's nice so I'm gonna take a look at it and then see and then I'm gonna make my way towards uh, Lincoln's tomb something I was interested in seeing just to show a little respect you know Cool how they got this whole neighborhood preserved. You know, they had all these old houses that are still here, still in good shape. They kept them up, maintained them. And so I'm gonna travel on to uh, his uh, gravesite. I want to see his tomb. I've seen a lot of YouTube videos with the inside of the house and stuff, so I'm not really too interested. It's typical Victorian. Well, I think I'm gonna blow out of here and uh, I'm gonna head down to. The Lincoln tomb. The day's already getting away from me, so gonna get moving and uh, head there. It's about a 20 minute ride from here, and then I gotta head to uh, St. Louis. So I just arrived to the Lincoln tomb, Abraham Lincoln, the burial site. I guess uh, he's buried here with his wife and three sons. And uh, there's a fourth son that's buried in Arlington National Cemetery. I think that's in Alexandria, Virginia. I actually went there uh, about a year ago on a business trip and visited uh, the site. General Robert E. Lee is buried there. South door of the monument is open facing the plaza from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. daily. We're going for a walk around. Supposedly the door is open uh, for a visit supposed to be the south side door which I'm thinking is this door I'm not sure if you can go on top of the monument that'd be pretty cool I'm probably the only one here today it's kind of spooky oh you scared me <laughs> uh, how's it going I thought I was the only one here uh, coming from uh, Boston Boston Massachusetts yes well, uh, burial chambers, fine. The burial chambers to the right. Uh, everyone is uh, buried here except for Robert Todd Lincoln, um, Lincoln's oldest son. Mm -hmm. He's buried in Arlington Cemetery. Okay. Yeah. Uh, just let me know if you have any questions. I will. Thank you. Is this something?
So directly across from Abraham Lincoln's tomb is uh, the tomb of his three sons and his wife, as you can see in the video. They're buried in a concrete structure right across from his tombstone. He's actually uh, buried 10 feet under the, his monument that's in the, in the tomb. And uh, Robert Todd Lincoln is Abraham Lincoln's first son. He's actually buried in Arlington National Cemetery. He served in the Civil War. Well, I guess he died from uh, some kind of a brain aneurysm or something. It looks like you can't go up the stairs up top, which I was hoping to do, but it's all right. So I was able to go inside and, and take a tour. It was like 10.40. There's a scary old tree for you. Well, this is uh, the highlights of my trip to Springfield. I was uh, coming to see Lincoln's grave in uh, his house. And, uh, got to eat some pretty decent food. Try a couple of breweries while I was here, which was good. I went to Odin and Isaacs, which was really, really good. They had some pretty good beer on tap. I went to uh, E Grain, that was really good. Locally sourced food from farms and all that stuff from around the neighborhood and part of Springfield. The food was delicious. They also had good beer on tap. But I'm going to be making my way back to Boston now. God bless America. How you doing there, YouTube? I just want to say uh, thanks for watching. And this about sums up my trip to St. Louis, Missouri, in Springfield, Illinois. And, uh, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. Click like. If you like my channel and want to see more content like this, please subscribe. Thanks again. See you soon.